Thanks for joining us today. Today I'm going to show you how to compact and repair a database in Access 2003. It's a fairly simple function, but it should be run regularly in order to maintain optimal performance of your database. This function has a chance to corrupt your database, even though it's supposed to improve performance. There are additional factors that lead to that, such as folder permissions and file size. If your file is getting very large, around 2 gigabytes, there's a chance that it could be corrupted already just by running it. So you're going to want to make sure to make a backup before doing a compact and repair. After you've made your backup, you're going to want to go ahead and open the file with an access. In order to do the compact and repair, you'll go to Tools, Database Utilities, Compact and Repair Database. Since my database was just created in around 10 seconds and only has one table and one report, it takes no time at all to compact and repair. If your file is very large, this process can take quite a while. You'll see a green loading bar at the bottom of the screen while it's compacting. Even if you see Access say not responding during this process, you're going to want to make sure you let it finish. If you stop a compact and repair in the middle, there's an additional chance that you corrupt your database. That really does it for the compact and repair right now. So if you want to see more videos like this, just subscribe to my channel and I'll make updates frequently. Thanks again for watching and hope you enjoyed. Oh, that's easy.